Hi everybody, so today we're going to be exploring Drive. So to find Drive, you could easily just go search it up. Or, which is more convenient, you could go to the 3x3 logo and click on it. It should say Google Apps underneath it if you, you click on it. So once you're there, you scroll down and you click on the Drive icon and it should bring you straight to the, your Drive homepage. On the search bar, you could search for any um, presentation that you have made so far or any individual presentation itself. The suggested bar are the ones that you might have recently been working on and it suggested for you. You could also find um, it on the search bar too. You, so you could click on the My Drive icon and it will bring you back. You could also click on the Shared With Me and it will bring you to the ones that are shared with you. You could also go to the computers and find folders. The recent ones are the most recently you have worked on. You could also go to the starred ones and then there's also a trash can that will be deleted after 30 days. There's also a storage where you can find almost everything that you need and there's also a storage icon, um, icon and that helps you find it more quickly. You can also see how much storage that you have used up so far. So, back to my drive. You could also, so here you could find, so this is the main like home page of the drive. So this is, and so to make new presentations, you could upload a folder, a file upload, a folder upload, Google Docs, Google Sheets, Google Slides, Google Forms, and more. Where there are more apps for you to upload. You could also connect more apps where you could download them and they'll be available to you too. There's also a template for almost every one of them. If you click on it, it'll, um, if you, you could also have a black doc, blank document. If you click on the templates area, then you could have um, templates for each one of them. It, the topic is already written out. You just have to um, erase all the, the works and you could just rewrite it in your own words. And that's also, and you can also search that up if you really want. And that is for all of them too. And you could also do it the advanced search. There's also settings. You could also get Drive for Desktop, which will get it make it easier for you to access it. And there's also a calendar at the side. And that is simply all you need to know about Drive. Thank you for listening.